One of the coolest aspects about the Kingdom Hearts series is being able to have classic Disney characters join you in your battles against the forces of darkness. Let's stick together for one more journey. To... where again? Welcome back to Destiny Island's Top 10, and today we'll be counting down our favorite Disney allies. We'll be grading them on their likability as characters, as well as their usefulness in combat. Junior Heroes always busy! You know it! To clarify, we're only looking at characters who actively join your party during at least one installment in the Kingdom Hearts franchise, so characters like Winnie the Pooh or Scrooge McDuck will not be featured in this list. Furthermore, we're excluding characters who fight alongside you but cannot be directly controlled by player input, so characters like Hercules in Kingdom Hearts 2 are also out. We're also excluding King Mickey from Kingdom Hearts 2, as rather than fight with your party, he simply replaces your party during the battles he's available. Lastly, we won't be considering any summon characters or characters that you can form dimension links with, as they deserve lists of their own someday. Gotcha! Number 10. Jack Skellington, Kingdom Hearts, and Kingdom Hearts 2. Of course! Halloween greetings from Jack Skellington, the Pumpkin King! As a huge fan of The Nightmare Before Christmas, it really kills me to place one of my favorite Disney characters so low on this list. But Jack Skellington's placement on this countdown really speaks to the disservice that I think the Kingdom Hearts franchise has done to the character. You know, the ones who wanted to spoil Halloween and Christmas? What are they called again? Heartless? In the movie, Jack is naive and overly ambitious without always thinking things through. But in the Kingdom Hearts games, he just comes across as being completely stupid. There's just something about the way the character is portrayed in the games, especially Kingdom Hearts 2, that I don't think accurately translates from how Jack Skellington was in the movie. Uh, Mr. Claus, I wanted to talk to you about Christmas first. It'll have to wait! That said, what saved Jack Skellington and ultimately awarded him a spot on our list is his prowess in combat. Jack is featured as a party member in both the original Kingdom Hearts and its follow-up Kingdom Hearts 2, and in both games, Jack demonstrates a mastery of magic spells that rivals that of even Donald. On top of that, in Kingdom Hearts 2, Jack's limit command, Dance Call, can be a real game changer when the going gets tough. Number 9. Ariel, Kingdom Hearts. Wait, I'm going with you. Ariel has never really been a likable character in our opinion, as she always comes across as being very ungrateful and self-centered. As the daughter of King Triton, the king of the entire ocean, she had it all, and even then, it was never good enough for her. So many places I want to see, I know I'll get there someday. But again, what awards Ariel a place on our countdown is her skills in battle. Ariel's abilities make her a true force to be reckoned with. Particularly, her spiral wave attack is borderline unfair when battling the Heartless. As long as you keep her MP replenished, Ariel can clear an entire room of enemies before you even know it. Number 8. Peter Pan. Kingdom Hearts. Who are you? I'm the answer to your prayers. Peter Pan is another Disney character that we've never really found likable. Both in the movie and the Kingdom Hearts series, he comes across as kind of being an arrogant, self-centered jerk. I mean, just look at what this guy does the very first time you even meet him. Hmm. I'm Peter Pan. I'm Sora. Okay. We're in this together, but only till we find Wendy. His character got slightly better in subsequent games he was featured in, but in terms of being a party member, Peter Pan is among the best the original Kingdom Hearts game has to offer. His hummingbird attack can single-handedly take down enemies with enormous HP bars, and his command over arrow and stop magic makes him a very useful ally in the secret battle against the dreaded Phantom. Freeze. See ya, Fire. Fire. Number 7. Hercules, Kingdom Hearts Recoded. You gotta tell me, how'd you do that? Hero, that's the job. We said that Hercules in Kingdom Hearts 2 was off limits, 
but he does actually join your party in another game in the series, Kingdom Hearts Recoded. During your visit to the Olympus Coliseum, Data Sora finds himself in an elaborate maze and joins forces with Hercules to navigate his way through. Here you go! Recoded was a game known for introducing many varying styles of combat, and in the Olympus Coliseum portion of the game, players actually get to team up with Hercules and eventually even Cloud to engage in classic turn-based RPG-style combat with the Heartless. It actually makes for one of the more enjoyable segments of Recoded's gameplay, and Hercules can certainly lay some serious smackdown. Number 6. Tron, Kingdom Hearts 2 My name is Tron. I'm a security program. Tron was a rather unexpected Disney pick to include in Kingdom Hearts 2, and yet he's among the best party members the game has to offer. As a character, Tron is really nothing special, and he's kind of bland. Most of his dialogue is him spitting out computer jargon to a confused Sora and player alike, and it makes for some mostly boring character exploration. Access channel? <laughs> I knew you'd ask. Where Tron really shines is in his combat. While he's mostly terrible during the initial few missions that Space Paranoids has to offer, once he gains access to his backup data, Tron becomes a real asset in battle. His setup limit command is capable of clearing entire rooms of Heartless, or depleting several bars of HP from stronger enemies and bosses. Plus, he's absolutely essential in taking down Space Paranoid's main boss, the MCP. Back in the game. Running your security. Number five, Donald Duck, Kingdom Hearts franchise. Oh, Donald, uh, you know I bet you the uh... Ah, what do you know, you big puyo cat? Everyone who's ever played a Kingdom Hearts game gives Donald such a bad rap. And we can't really say we disagree with them either. Donald! I'm sorry! In combat, Donald has a plethora of powerful magic spells at his disposal, but his low HP and weaker stats form a bad combination that often leaves him knocked out after a single hit from even the weakest of enemies. Donald's timing with supportive and healing magic is typically off as well, healing you with cure magic mere seconds after you've already wasted the MP to heal yourself. The list of Donald's flaws can go on and on. Maybe we'll even make a whole top 10 list of those in the future. What? What brings Donald much higher on our list is his infectious likability as a character. As one of Disney's most iconic characters, you can't help but love him, even despite all of his shortcomings in battle. Whenever Donald's on screen, we love every second of it. Number 4. Beast, Kingdom Hearts, and Kingdom Hearts 2. Why? Why did you... you come here? I came. To fight for Bell. As one might assume based on his appearance alone, Beast is an absolute powerhouse. One of the strongest physical attackers in both Kingdom Hearts and Kingdom Hearts 2, Beast is capable of leveling powerful enemies with a single swipe of his claws. His lunge attacks can take out entire clusters of weaker Heartless with ease, and his twin howl limit command in Kingdom Hearts 2 is devastating to all that get caught in the blast bath. Yeah, yeah. Get out. On top of his prowess in battle, Beast is a truly likable character. As someone who struggles to overcome his own darkness, he's naturally a character people want to root for. Despite his flaws and short temper, his love for Belle and more charming moments make him one of Disney's more enjoyable anti-heroes. Belle, I I'm sorry, I, I wasn't myself. I hope I haven't done anything to hurt you. Number 3. Mulan, Kingdom Hearts 2 It ends now. Right now! When she first joins your party as the inexperienced Ping, she's not all that great to have as a member of your team. But when she gives up the charade and rejoins the party as herself, Mulan is a powerful asset to have in battle. Her quick work with a sword, coupled with Mushu's wide-range fireball attacks, make her one of the best allies in all of Kingdom Hearts 2. 
Take this! For China! Fire! Plus, Mulan is a totally likable character. I know I don't need to bring up just how much girl power this character has going for her, but on top of that, she just has such an infectious personality. Much of that can be attributed to the stellar voice work of Ming-Na Wen, who voiced Mulan in both the film and Kingdom Hearts 2, but the character herself is just someone you can't help but root for. You didn't notice? Not me! I think it's working. Oh no, those two would fall for anything! Number 2. Aladdin, Kingdom Hearts, and Kingdom Hearts 2. Hi Sora! Come back here! Maybe it's the fact that Aladdin was the first Disney movie I had ever seen growing up, but there's just something about him that makes him one of my favorite Disney characters of all time. His is one of the most classic underdog, rags to riches stories ever, and his personality and charm make you cheer for him every step of the way. You see, there's this girl in Agrabah named Jasmine, but she's a princess, and I'm... Ah, she could never fall for a guy like me. In battle, Aladdin is extremely good at slicing and dicing up Heartless with the use of his trusty sword, and his agility is matched by few other characters in the franchise. In the original Kingdom Hearts, Aladdin could match blades with the best of them, but in Kingdom Hearts 2, it's practically unfair how good of an ally he is. He's fast, capable of dealing seemingly endless strings of blows, and thanks to his speedster limit command, He's also able to generate vast amounts of drive points from out of thin air. If that just isn't the best, then we don't know what is. Number 1. Goofy, Kingdom Hearts Franchise the only character in our book that could possibly fill this spot. Goofy is absolutely our pick for the greatest Disney ally the Kingdom Hearts series has given us so far. Every single thing that this character does just fills us with such overwhelming joy that there's no way he could not have been number one. We did it! First, there's his character, which is possibly the most iconic in all of Disney, second only to the main mouse himself. Everything about Goofy is just so, well, Goofy. He's funny, charismatic, and loyal to the very end. For crying out loud, this guy took a boulder to the skull to protect his friends and just shook it off like it was no big deal. Now that is a dependable friend. You know, that really hurt! Aw, Goofy! Of course, your majesty, I get bumped on the head all the time! On top of his lovable character is his skills as a warrior in the Kingdom Hearts series. While he may not be the most powerful of all the possible allies you have at your disposal, Goofy is so clutch it's not even funny. In the original Kingdom Hearts, his MP gift ability made him an absolute must-have in every battle. And in Kingdom Hearts 2, his limit commands are capable of taking out high HP single targets, or low HP groups with the greatest of ease. Plus his high defensive stats and HP make him a sturdy ally to have in battle, unlike a certain duck that we could possibly mention. Why do you have to do that? So those are our picks for the top 10 Disney allies. Do you agree with our list? Who are your go-to Disney companions when you play a Kingdom Hearts game? Let us know in the comments below. And for more Destiny Islands Top 10 Countdowns, be sure to subscribe. Until next time, I'm Other Promise 13 from DestinyIslands.com.